The family of a 31-year-old woman, Johanita Dogby, who was stabbed and killed in broad daylight, have paid tribute to her describing her as beautiful and kind-hearted. The attack took place around 4.30 p.m. on May 1, 2023, Bank Holiday Monday, in Brixton, close by to Dogby's home. It's currently believed that the man who attacked Dogby was a stranger to her. Police arrested a 33-year-old man in connection to the stabbing on Tuesday. He is currently in custody and being questioned by officers, who are trying to establish a motive for the heinous crime. Dogby's father, Yao, said, We have no words at this moment. My daughter was beautiful and kind-hearted. I'm sorry, I can't say anything more. Maurice, Dogby's brother, added that they are completely broken as a family and are still trying to comprehend what has happened. As far as we know, there was no link between my sister and the attacker. We are waiting to meet with the police to get a full update, he said. This whole thing has left us devastated. It's too much for us. Dogby was the founder of the Odette Foundation, a charity that supports those with sickle cell disease in Ghana and Togo. A colleague from the foundation told the Evening Standard, she really was a good person. It's reported that Dogby was on her way home to the flat she shares with her parents and siblings, having left to buy her mother a birthday gift. An anonymous member of the public told press, I was with her dad at the crime scene. He said his daughter had gone to buy a present for her mother and, and was on her way home. She was on the phone to her grandmother when she was attacked. The grandmother heard a terrible scream and then the phone dropped. The grandmother phoned the dad who then tried to call his daughter's number but got no answer. If it is random, it's terrifying. It's a brazen attack in the open, in daylight. Our thoughts are with all of Dogby's loved ones at this deeply sad time.